Hey guys, and welcome back to this Portsmouth FIFA 21 Road to Glory career mode as we continue our ascendancy through the football leagues, aiming to get to the Premier League. We're of course in the Championship now. We've made a perfect start to the league season. Looking to continue that. First game will be a tough one though. Away to Watford, who sits 15th, so not the best of starts for them. We've also got a cup game in this episode with a game against Cardiff City, I think, sandwiched in between. For this one at Vicarage Road, of course, I do have to start Bobby Beveridge. I can't leave him out after he's shown that his left foot is a weapon like that. Two wonder goals in the last episode, hoping for another one here today. There's your team in full. I've gone for Ricky J. Jones and John Marquis up top today. Just, I don't know, felt like a bit of freshness. Might do us some good. Curtis Thompson, Beveridge and Wilkes in midfield. Seddon, Norris, Watmore, Johnson and Big Mac in goal. 5-3-2 again. That seems to be the... Uh, What's ordered off the menu by a lot of teams? They always seem to play that. But Tom Cleverley, Will Hughes in midfield. They've got a decent little team here. Watford not made the best of starts, like we said. We're hoping that we can pile on some misery. Good tackle. Marquis, whose place is under constant threat. Oh, yep. Yeah. Just about springs the offside trap. Seddon inside to Thompson. Outside to Curtis. Go on, boy. Looking for Ricky J. Jones. Oh, the defender knows exactly what he's doing there. You could say it's good defending. Just blocked him off. He knows that Jones has probably got him for pace. So he just made sure that Jones wouldn't get there. Good play. Watford coming forward. Good attack. Seddon. Good tackle. Norris finds Curtis. Curtis twisting, turning into Thompson. Out to Ricky J. Jones. Back to Thompson. Although it deflects back into his path. Ricky J. Jones here to give us the lead. Ricky J. Jones. It's saved. Got to gobble those chances up, man. Corner. Can we gobble this up? Norris is the man it goes towards. What a header. And it's cleared off the line. Thompson finds Jack. Back to Ben Thompson. Whack. It's cleared away. Good pressure. Watford have not started well. It's like... I don't want to calm things. I don't want to jinx stuff. But it's quite clear to see why they haven't started brightly this season. They're very defensive. It's quite easy to pick them apart, even though they are very defensive. And when they come forward, they kind of just stop. Kind of run out of ideas. I told you, this is going to jinx it up. This is going to be bad karma. Instant bad karma. Johnson looking for Wilkes. Cuts inside onto his stronger left foot. Got something he's going to look to do quite a bit, I think. He finds Seddon with a good ball. Seddon. Curtis outside him. Go on, Rona. Go on, Ronan. Ricky J. Jones has gone. Oh, that would have been the time to play it. Instead, I don't know what he's going to do here. He doesn't know what he's going to do. He's going to get tackled. That's what he's going to do. Marquis looks up. Sees the run of Wilkes. Wilkes, who's been quiet since joining. We know he's left footed. It's on his right foot. Instead, he goes across. Go on, he hits the bar, man. Can't come much closer than that. So unlucky. Malik Wilkes. Dead in. Looking for the... Oh, hello. It's showboating for you. Here's Bobby Beveridge. Going to go out to Johnson. Wilkes on the overlap. Come so close to scoring moments ago. Puts it into Marquis. And that's blocked. Ball is laid off to the edge of the box. Bobby Beveridge wants it on that left foot of his. Trying to create half a yard of space. Half-time whistle goes somehow. Still nil-nil. Ball inside. Thompson finds Ricky J. Jones. Going to lay this off to John Marquis. Had a run at. Instead, Ricky J. Jones is now the runner. Is he going to beat the keeper to it? Oh, I tried a little ball roll. Tried a little ball roll, but he's dived on it. We've gone a bit quiet in the second half. A little bit quiet. Ben Foster's had a good game, as you've seen. Here's Wilkes with John Marquis. Great layoff. Oh, I was trying to lay it off one more to Curtis, man. He was completely three, uh, three? completely free at the back stick there. Just ghosted in. No one picking up the runs. But we've got 24 minutes to find the breakthrough here. The longer this stays nil-nil, I think the more the home side are going to think they can get something from this game. I wouldn't be happy with the point based on the chances that we've had. That's good play from Seddon. Curtis. He's the run of Ricky J. Jones. Looks to find him. Might have got the wrong side of his man here. No, good defending. Snuffed out the attack into the last 10 minutes. Watford on the attack. Get out to him. Well in. Bobby wins that. Marquis. Go, Ricky. Go. Go on, Ricky. Go. You've scored from these kind of angles before in League One. Ah, oh, Ben Foster. Double change. Charlie Austin and Ben Close coming on for Marquis. And Beveridge. Corner to be delivered. Keep it away from the goalkeeper. We've done that. Jack Watmore goes up. Header doesn't stay away from the goalkeeper, though. Five remaining. Five minutes. Ball into feet. Oh, it's a great ball. Quick shot on the turn as well. Big Mac had to be alert. 
into stoppage. Is he given a penalty? You are joking me. What? That is the worst refereeing decision I have ever seen. I wasn't even in control of him at that point. We could lose this game here. I'm going to step up down the middle. Big Mac! Come on! Justice. Justice has been done. Corner. Get it clear. Johnson. Yeah, whack it away. Full-time whistle's about to go. It's finished nil-nil. But it was a very entertaining game. We had so many chances in the first half to win it. And Watford had the best chance deep into stoppage time. So next game is actually Birmingham City, not Cardiff. Like I said at the start of the video. I just saw a glimpse of the badge, saw it was blue, assumed it was Cardiff. If it's not, it's Birmingham. Um, change the front line again after firing a blank. Uh, Jones, Marquis, good players. Will definitely feature this season, but I've gone back to Austin and Parrott. No one's really grabbing all the goals here in the championship for us. Nobody. We need that guy that we can go, you're the man. Like Bruno Fernandes is for Man U. You're the man that's going to get us out of any games where we're struggling. You're the one we're going to look to. We haven't got that guy. It was Ronan Curtis in League One. Is it going to be Curtis in the championship? I'm not sure. There is your team then. Few changes. You can see the front line change. Midfield stays the same. I have faith in that midfield. Said and Norris, what more? Uh, stay the same as well. But Sassy comes in at right back to give Johnson a bit of a breezer. Bre breezer? Breezer? Breaver. It's a 4-4-1-1. Nice to see someone not playing five at the back for a change. Hopefully. Hopefully we can break them down a bit more easily. But Djukovic up top. Always a threat. Bobby Beveridge. Parrot made a run. Didn't find him. Instead we look to Curtis. Here is a chance for him to be that guy. Ronan Curtis. It's saved. Beveridge following up. Cleared away. Birmingham remaining composed at the back. Despite some early pressure. Please don't be a game like the last one where we don't break them down. Bobby Beveridge. Bobby Beveridge. Oh, you know he can do it. Good save from Etheridge. Comfortable save from Etheridge. Didn't even need to parry it. He just held it. But we've got Birmingham camped inside their own half. Parrott here. Got Austin with him. Troy Parrott. Slow motion step over. Slow mo. Got to burst into that gap. Seddon. Into Charlie Austin. who go. Oh, mate. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Troy Parrott. That's a bit better in terms of footwork. He's... Norris has come out of defence. Committed and not made it. It's now like two or three on two here. Two or three on two. In Birmingham City's favour. But Norris gets back. Makes up for his error. Wow. That was a let off. That was a chance for Birmingham. Can we turn this into an attack of our own here? Austin. Parrott. Parrott burst onto it. Troy Parrott. He's being held back. Ref will take the free kick. We'll take it. Right, let's go. Charlie Austin. And Lou here lays it off. Ben Thompson, whack. Take it closer. Birmingham coming forward. Constant threat from both teams so far. That's a great bit of football. He's offside. He's offside. Whew. Tassi. Drills it into Wilkes. Wilkes inside. Parrot. Here's Charlie Austin. I don't want another long shot. I want Austin to do his thing. He goes into the box. That's a pen. And he lashes out in retaliation. Dassey. Into Bobby Beveridge. Nice footwork. Finds Wilkes. Turns into trouble. Approaching half time here. There might be one decent chance left for either side. Jack wins the ball back. Charlie Austin needs support. Parrot. Back to Austin. Austin looks up. Sees the run of Malik Wilkes. Ah, oh, defender sees it as well. Just about gets there. It's been scrappy. We've created chances, but not clear-cut chances. We're going to go in half-time, all square, for the second game in a row. Firing a blank. Is a change in formation needed? I don't think so. I think we're playing the, the better stuff in these games. And let's face it, four games into our championship season, three wins and a draw. Nothing's broken. It's just frustrating when you're dominating games and not winning them. Curtis out wide. Ronan Curtis. Put it across the middle. No one in there. No one there first. No one making that run. Malik Wilkes. Come on, boy. He's been so quiet. He's been the most quiet, probably, of the new signings, to be fair. Although he has got Troy Parrott inside. Parrott lays it off. Laid off one more. Ronan Curtis. Touch and finish. There it is. Brilliantly works. That was like a rugby move. Playing it down the line. Across to the runner who comes in off the wing and applies the finish to get all the glory. Ronan Curtis. And I'm relieved, man. I thought we were never going to score. But look, Parrot 
to Thompson, onto Curtis who stayed onside and that is a cool, calm and collected finish. Oh, Thompson, love that. Curtis, look for Charlie Austin. Charlie Austin looking to bulldoze his way through here. He might use his strength and his experience. Oh, good block. Well played. Corner driven in towards Charlie Austin. Oh, off the keeper's legs. Off his knees. Birmingham coming forward in search of an equaliser. Taking on Sassy here. Sassy stands up to the task. Ball is chipped over the top though. Oh, that's brilliant. They're through. Big Mac. What a save. That was awful defending. Thompson brings the ball away. Charlie Austin. Goes right, Parrot. Parrot, oh no, Troy, where are you going? Oh, Troy, he's fallen over as well. Troy, get up, son. Jack with some defending to do. Already on a yellow, had to be careful there. He had a little nibble, didn't he? I was worried about him being sent off. Malik Wilkes, looking over the top for uh, Miracle. It's going to be a double change. Parrot and Beveridge off. Naylor coming in for some experience in midfield. And Balogun up top. Is it Balogun? Balogun? Balahan? I don't know. That guy. You know the one. The Arsenal youngster. Oh, no. Jack. Oh, no. Jack, how have you been turned? How have you been turned? It's a late, late equaliser here for Birmingham City. I cannot believe it. That defending was so bad. Jack, what more to blame? He was turned. Look at the police, as if it's kicking off. There, we committed with Norris. That was bad. And then Jack, he's gone to chest it. Just try and get your nuts on it, son. Get it out of danger. Curtis, inside to Thompson. Here is the youngster. He finds Charlie Austin. Charlie Austin looking back for it. Oh, the first touch was minging. Absolutely minging. And he goes down. What are you doing? Just get up. Ted and wins that. Important foot in. Ball played forward to the youngster again. Oh, mate, his ball control is worse than Romelu Lukaku at the moment. Full-time whistle goes, Portsmouth 1, Birmingham 1, and that isn't good enough. So the next game is, of course, a cup game. So I thought I'd have a look at the league table after that draw. We are fifth. We're uh, fourth. Oh, my God, I can't even read. Game's played five. We are fourth in the table. Three wins, two draws, so we're still unbeaten. Goal difference is positive. Everything's pretty, pretty positive. The reason I thought we were playing Cardiff next in the league was because we've actually got Cardiff now in the next round of the, uh, of the cup. So... Interesting to see. It's obviously the second round, the EFL Cup. People are chatting. People want to play. We've got Cannon saying he feels a bit insecure. Just say you're doing great, even though he's not really doing anything. Um, yeah, we might might adjust the team a little bit for this. So Cardiff away. Not going to be easy. Round two, EFL Cup. We're not going to win it, but a good cup run would be nice. But we've made a load of changes. As you can see, pretty much Curtis, Norris, Charlie Austin maybe, and Jack Watmore, the only real players to keep their places. Sassy in right back, Raggett. Brown coming in at left back. We've pushed Norris into midfield with close. Harness starts on the right. Charlie Austin and Balogun up top. 4-4-1-1 for Cardiff City. It's kind of a 4-2-3-1, isn't it, really? Win here, and we head into the third round of the competition, which would be absolutely lovely. Don't think we're going to win it. You could win it. A lot of Premier League clubs don't really take this competition too seriously. So... If we were to get to the latter stages and were to start taking it seriously, you never know. You never know what could happen. Close. Looking for Harness. Harness to find Balogun. Balogun around the corner. Charlie Austin touch. Charlie Austin finished. Portsmouth 1-0. Perfect start. Inside six minutes. Charlie Austin. Rolling back the years. Good play. Good build-up play. Harness into Balogun. Knew where Austin was. And he's just so composed in front of goal. Man of his experience. Looks happy with his goal as well. Charlie Austin could be in again here. Oh, what is happening to Cardiff? Can he stay composed again, Charlie Austin, and make it too? Absolutely right. Charlie Austin, are we going to see the same celebration? Yes, we are. Charlie Austin really rubbing salt into the wounds of these Cardiff fans here. Or maybe they just don't care. This time it's Ben Close who slips the ball through. Very similar goals. It's like deja vu here. Just power. Dream start. Dream start. Where have these goals been? In the league. And we need them. Don't forget these lads that don't usually play coming in. They've got a chance to stake a claim for a regular first team place here. So it is important. So they are motivated. Unless you're Bass. Where you're probably not motivated or concentrating. 2-1. And that is an awful, awful goalkeeping error. Let's have a little look. See what happens. Ball is played in there. Oh, he's got to save that. He's got to do better. 
one that he won't want to see again. Good ball through. Brown's the man chasing back. I think we've done enough. Raggett's back there as well. Sassy doing his best. Cross comes in. Needs to be dealt with at the back. Stick it isn't, but Bass redeems himself. Good save. Cardiff corner. Comes in. Straight at Bass. He's not filling me with much confidence, I won't lie. Last year I found him quite impressive, quite reliable. It's obviously that period where Big Mac went off to international duty. And Bass was fine. But shaky today, to say the least. That's good defending. Well played. Let's get it out. Let's get it to Charlie Austin. Balogun. Oh, Harness. You're completely through. Why have they left you? Why have they left you? To restore our two-goal advantage. Harness. Ronan Curtis. You could probably do with the breather. I think he plays an awful lot. Here is Charlie Austin. Sassy going forward. There he is. Sassy onto Harness. Onside, I believe. Marcus Harness. No. He's missed it. Rebound. No. Two unbelievable chances for him today. And he hasn't taken any of them. Raggett goes up. Another corner. As Cardiff head the ball away. Oh, he'll be wondering how he hasn't gotten the score sheet. We're wondering how we're not two goals in front. Charlie Austin looking for a hat trick. He heads the ball over this time. Austin. Austin looking for Harness. That's a great ball. Balogun in the middle. Curtis at the back stick. Can we pick him out? Yes, we can. Oh, Sign this keeper. Sign him immediately. Couple of great saves he's made today. That one probably being the best of the bunch. Cardiff have a free kick. No idea why we're still playing. We've like doubled the allotted added time. It's headed away. It's going to be a Cardiff corner. And the referee and the officials will let them take it. If we can see now, I'll be so mad. Corner comes in. Headed away by Jack. Ref, that should be half time. Thank you very much. So into the second half we go. Close. Switches it. Curtis into Norris. Not really... Is he running things in that midfield? I'm not sure. He hasn't been more impressive than anyone else, really. Hasn't been bad either. Here's Balogun. All over the top. Defending to be done. Raggett doing his best to get back there. Done brilliantly. Had to get that spot on. Otherwise, of course, it would have been a pen. And Curtis conceding the corner. Looks a bit confused. As if to say, what on earth have I done that for? I can't answer that question for you, mate. I don't know why you did that. Corner comes in. It is dealt with. Arnes cuts inside. Looking for Charlie Austin, who's got there. Oh, nice back heel as well. Norris. On to Ronan Curtis. Please restore our two-goal advantage. Please, Ronan. Please, Ronan. That's how you finish it. Show Harness. Where is he? There he is. Let's go and show him how to finish. Yeah, follow me, son. I'll show you the way. Come on. Come on. Over here. Assist for Norris that time. And I never felt like Ronan Curtis would miss. Look at the finish. Right into the top corner. Away from the goalkeeper. Nothing he could do about that one. Poor Smithies. Yes, Norris. I like him in midfield. I really do. Go on, Curtis. Go on, Ronan. Oh, why have you got so much space? Ronan Curtis. Harness. I've shown you how to finish. Go and do it. Oh, nearly. Woo. Yes, close. Austin, Balogun. Ben close. Harness, offside. Close. Out to Harness. Little step over. Here come Cardiff. Trying to find a way back into this game. We don't want to let him. We don't want to let him. We're going to let him. We're going to let him. Bass. That's better. That's a good save. Right. Whatever criticism he's had, he's made a couple of saves now to kind of redeem himself. Was that a save he should have made? I don't think so. Just don't make another error. Oh, that's a hell of a save. Pretty sure he's got fingers to that. But Cardiff are not lying down. They're not done here. We've absolutely taken him out. I want to watch a replay of that, that effort. But there we go. Pretty sure he got fingers to this. Pretty sure. Oh, that's a hell of a save. Triple change being made. Cannon, Parrot, Beveridge. All coming on. Let's go, boys. Fresh energy. Curtis. Curtis. Go on, boy. Parrot making a move. Troy Parrot making a move. Balogun making a move. And that's the finish. And that's the game. Surely. 
Boos ring out at the Cardiff City Stadium. I don't know why they'd be so feisty about the Carabao Cup, or the EFL Cup, I should say, but it is what it is. First goal in Pompey Colours for Balogun, and that'll do him the world of good in terms of confidence. But how about the ball in from Ronan Curtis? Look at it. Here's Balogun. There we go. Ronan Curtis, who's starting to run things here. Back stick. Harness. Oh, I want to volley that. Oh, that was bad. Full time whistle goes into the third round. We go. Booze. That's what you like to hear when you're the away team. Booze. So that is where we end this one. Successful episode? Yeah, probably. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know how you feel about draws in there. Championship. You've got to kind of remember that we are a league above where we were last year and we're in no rush to get to the Premier League. I'd of course like to do it as quickly as possible, but I'm going to say the same as what I said at the start of last season. Playoffs would be unbelievable in our first season in the Championship. Also, as it's about as believable as Rodri going from Man City to Tottenham for 106 million. But hey, that's by the by, that's nothing to do with us. But that's where we're going to end it, guys. Drop a like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I'll see you in the next one.